next? There must be a decent actor in this lot somewhere that can bring life to my masterpiece. Has Sir, Sir Philip confirmed? Oh, yes, sir, he's confirmed. He'll be travelling up from London in time for our opening night. At last, a West End producer coming to see my little play. This could be the making of all of us. If only we could get some talent on that stage. You there. Weave your magic with my script. A supreme ruler of the people, I will cross this rebellion. Uh, look, look. All right, thanks. That's enough. Oh, next. You there. You're going to play this part dressed as a policeman? No, sir. I am actually a policeman. And I must warn you. Ah, oh, warnings. I don't need warnings. I need actors. Who's next? Um, oh, this is the last one, sir. Well, you better be good then. I am the supreme ruler of the people. I will quash this rebellion and slaughter every man, woman and child. Bit hammy. But you might do. Have you done anything before? Here's my CV. Oh, thank you. Alex Bartholomew. I think I've heard of you. Yes, you've been doing some good work on the Scottish circuit. Hmm, and someone the great unwashed will have heard of. Congratulations, you're our man. Well, thank you, thank you very much. So, you're uh, big in Scotland, are you? Hmm, I suppose I am. You play the Edinburgh Playhouse? Hmm, I, I think so. Hmm, I thought I recognised the name. So... That's Alex Bartholomew. Do you know him? Oh, unfortunately, yes. I mean, I've never met him, but I know what he's like. He's a snake in corduroy trousers. Oh, yeah. I used to be a struggling actor. Then one day, I got my big break in a big show. I was all set for stardom. And then, the day before opening night, the producer heard that his old mate Alex Bartholomew was in town, just like that. I was out and he was in. I never got cast for anything again. Now he's coming in and taking the lead all over again. I always said if I ever met him, I'd punch his lights out. Wouldn't you rather see him stabbed? Hmm? Oh, yes. He gets stabbed at the end mm. of the play, doesn't he? Yeah. How are you going to do that on stage? <laughs> what would happen if, theoretically, the uh, knife got stuck. Uh, that would hurt. Mm. Yeah. Mm. And he'd have to lie there on stage, pretending to be dead, suffering in silence. Well, don't worry, these knives never go wrong. Of course not. That would be awful. I must say, you do look different to the last time I saw you on stage. Do I? Yes. I remember you were a lot taller and thinner. Well, I'm, I'm sure that can be put down to the lighting and the makeup. And at that time, you were a lot more female. <sighs> All right. I'm not Alex Bartholomew. I didn't think that you would want to uh, cast an unknown into that role. So. I just pretended to be him. Her? Oh, her. I thought nobody would know him. Her? Why, <sighs> her. My name, my name is actually John Peterson. I was brought up in an orphanage and all I wanted to do was to go on the stage and act. Oh, you poor thing. During my childhood, uh, I had this uh, stum stammer, which um, I did overcome because I just wanted to li live my dream. Don't worry. I'll keep your secret. Oh, thank you. 
Where's my lead actor? We go live in four hours. You're going well, Duncan. Oh, oh Sir Philip. Sir, uh, sir. <laughs> Hi, I've just heard Sir Philip is in the building. Ah. Ah. Uh, sir Philip, yes, everything's going well. You know what they say? Bad dress, good show. By the looks of this, the show should be a roaring success then. But if it turns out well, we can look at our transfer to the West End. Right, where's the bar? Sorry, I was just helping out for uh, in the cloakroom for tonight's performance. Action! You're the one person stopping the Republic from, from rising up and freeing the people. This one's for Sarah! Sarah! Not sure this scene is really working, you know. I can't put my finger on it. I think I shall go and consult with my muse. Revenge is a dish best served in front of 200 people. Did you figure out what was wrong with the stabbing scene? Ah, two shots of brandy and inspiration struck. Much better now. Yeah, and there's some Mm. There wasn't enough drama with getting stabbed in the back, you know? No, he's going to be stabbed in the throat. Throat? Mm. Oh, oh, no. no, no. Retractable blade, you know? Won't hurt a bit. The throat? I can't. This is for Sarah. Stop! Yes. This is the... This is the wrong knife. I swapped it over because... Well, because Alex Bartholomew ruined my career. I could have been a successful actor. But he stole my big break and doomed me to a miserable life of nothing but being a... assistant director. Stop! He's not Alex Bartholomew. He didn't ruin your career. He's John Peterson. He's a poor, stammering orphan. He just wanted a fair chance on the stage. Stop! He is not John Peterson. His name is Bill Watkins. Wallets have been taken from the cloakroom. And I recognise your leading actor as a notorious con man. I really understand the ending, but I'm sure it was very clever. How can I make this happen every night? <laughs> 